Together, we are stronger. She was a, a, a loved person. She had a family, and, and uh, in the end, she was one of our children collectively. April 8, 2021 marks the one-year anniversary since 16-year-old Aisha Hudson was shot and killed by Winnipeg police. Family and friends are gathered here at the Odina Circle to honour and pay tribute to her life. You're just as bad when you stay silent. Silence is violence. Balloons that read missing and murdered were released into the air by members of Aisha's family. This gathering Thursday evening at the Odina Circle at the Forks is because of an incident that happened one year ago with an alleged theft from a liquor mart in Sage Creek that quickly escalated on the evening of April 8, 2020. Police say multiple suspects were driving a stolen vehicle and were attempting to escape from pursuing officers. This led to a destructive chase that ended at Lajemodier Boulevard and Furmore Avenue when an officer fired at the driver. The driver was later identified as Hudson. She was taken to hospital but later died of her injuries. I know this is a very hard day, but it's also a very beautiful day because of how many people have come here today to show their love to stand in solidarity with the family, to say we will not stay silent until we achieve justice for Aisha. The family has uh, uh, endeavoured to bring a lot of advocacy to this issue as to what the circumstances that led to uh, the tragic death of Aisha Hudson, you know, bringing about uh, discussions on systemic uh, racism, systemic dis issues. Uh, with uh, uh, the police force, and uh, today was actually very significant. We reached out to Winnipeg Police for a response on the one-year anniversary and replied to City News saying, we have no comment. On January 28, 2021, after a 10-month-long investigation, the Independent Investigation Unit released their findings on the matter. The Manitoba Prosecutions was not recommending any criminal charges against the subject officer. I believe it needs to change. There needs to be more civilian oversight. There needs to be more more uh, independent investigators that are involved with the process, right? It shouldn't be about such a heavy police uh, presence on, on, that, uh, on that committee. And uh, uh, with that said, there's obviously an appetite. In honor of the one year anniversary, similar memorials were held across the country in Vancouver, Toronto and Halifax. In Winnipeg, Alex Carpa City News.